वेलकम टू हेल्दी टॉक शो एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक विथ मिस्टर निखिल वजीरानी सो ही इज टेकिंग द लेगेसी ऑफ ट्रांस एशिया एंड अरबा टू द ग्लोबल रीजन सो हेलो निखिल सो प्लीज लेट अस इंट्रोड्यूस अबाउट योर सेल्फ यू आर द यंग चैप ऑफ अरबा डायग्नोस्टिक्स सो आवर व्यूवर्स इज नॉट अवेयर अबाउट योर so please let us introduce sure um my name is nikhil vazirani i'm suresh vazirani's son i've been in the company now almost 8 years um and my job has my vision here has been to transform our company uh you know beyond india and to a real player in the emerging markets um the vision which the company was founded in india was to help uh, serve as many people as possible with quality innovative diagnostics and um uh, we've been mark leaders in india for a number of years and uh, we saw that the similar need exists outside india in similar emerging markets uh, where they don't have uh, the same uh, quality diagnostic that we have here in india so we want to try and take our success in india and try to bring the same um benefits to users patients doctors in south america and brazil in eastern europe and africa and that's uh, what we continue to do here so how you are seeing the middle east market especially you are exhibiting in arab uh, med lab so what is your experience the middle east market is an interesting market because um it's not a very mature market uh, the market is driven a lot by uh, immigration and the whole market depends on kind of what the governments are doing it's you know as you know it's very top down driven market um saudi arabia has been the primary growth driver for the market in the last couple of years so um by far the biggest market here in the middle east and will continue to be one of the most important countries in the region so last uh, 15 years and uh, mr suresh wazirani is uh, Uh, driving this company for last 42 years so he has taken the company up big level so what you have taken from your father as a business okay. guide um i think uh my father definitely i would definitely say a unique uh, approach to to doing businesses um even even after all the success after everything is achieved i i don't think he's any even 1% less hungry less uh, ambitious today than he was you know 42 years ago when he started the company because i think every day he comes to work and he's always excited by the potential the opportunity um you know india now is the most populous country in the world it's a problem for some people but the same another word for problem is opportunity so i think he's excited by the opportunity every day he comes and for us as an organization you know we've done a lot but there's still a lot more to go there's still a lot of people that we don't reach there's still a lot of uh, countries we're not in and we we try to expand and try to let's say help as many lives as possible and we've reached many but i think there's many more uh many more uh, countries populations that we haven't a lot of um a lot of products that we haven't brought to market a lot of uh, new assays new tests that we can uh, bring to market so for us um we're just getting started so this has been a bit of a like a warm up you can say we think we think the best is yet to come so every year we try to get to new heights and i think uh, you know the company has its dna inside it and this is what i inherited everybody here has a kind of sixth sense approach of what he likes what he doesn't like so he doesn't have to tell them what to do they they kind of already feel his dna inside the company so so what is your vision for this company and where you want to see the company after 5 years i think i think the fundamental values of the company was founded on still continue to be very relevant today um we still continue to be a company focused on emerging markets our our our, our vision has always been a volume and not profit we're not a margin profit driven company we're here to uh, have a large part of the market because that enables us to get to more patients more doctors more customers and we will always be interested to uh, put our customers first and so we never have a challenge compromising profit where we see this 
some good we can do in the world where our products can be used can help um, patients around the world so i think fundamentally that's quite different from us but of course we're not a non-profit company but we're not a profit first company so i think that as an important uh, founding pillar gives us a lot of opportunities to grow i think um, yeah and i think um, taking some of these values that we have to be a customer service customer focused company so we're not a technology focused company we don't develop products that our scientists or engineers can dream up but we always ask the customer what they're interested in what their problems are and some days their problems are hematology another problem so another day it's molecular so we always open to expanding the company to solve our customers solutions regardless of what technology that might be and if we don't have that we try and find a partner or we try to develop it in house for them so so we're very much a customer centric company we're not there are many companies in the industry that tend to kind of label themselves from the beginning as you know we're a molecular company we're a chemistry company hematology company and then they don't want to do anything else and that's kind of shows you their limitation that they've already set the border that this is what our engineers or technical people can develop only and we're not interested to do anything else so it's one way to run a company and we've always been uh close to our customers so for us whatever our customer needs are software uh instruments reagents whatever that might be tomorrow it might even be people or uh quality control whatever that might we always going to be very focused on trying to bring the bring a solution to them so i think this is what's kind of built our success so far and we'll we still see that's working so on you know as long as we're doing something right there's a there's a need for us our customers want us we'll be here and we'll always try to do better every day so that's great that you are listening to your customer and definitely i can uh, see your vision that you can take your legacy of your father to a different level thank you so much for being with us and talking to mergate today tv my pleasure thanks so much